from Irkutsk. And uh, a couple of words. You know, Irkutsk is a geospatial uh, city. They use a lot of scanners, and they have more scanners per capita, I think, there than in any other city of the world. If we don't take Sadove uh, Kaltso from Moscow. Sure. Thank you very much, uh, dear colleagues. The previous presentation was very interesting. I liked that a lot. So I asked Mr. Adruf, uh to include or insert my presentation in the uh, conference uh, presentation list as a follow-up to what was said. So we used to do a project in Irkutsk in 2011-2012 uh, uh, using a Leica uh, scanner RCD30 for Baikal Forest Inventory Enterprise. So we realized that we're getting abundant, overabundant information. So we were wondering whether we could put it to good use. So I will sound kind of repetitive. We approached uh, by Cal uh, Les and other uh, municipal authorities, forest authorities, and uh, we have uh, a proposal to look at this uh, technology more closely, not in global terms, but in the amount that is uh, suitable for this technology. As I said, uh, we used ALS 60, uh, 60 uh, laser scanner, and we were able to receive uh, a, a digital um, surface model, digital elevation model, vis-a-vis uh, uh, the uh, Earth line. We also generated orthophoto plans in RGB and in um, uh, near infrared. Uh, based on laser scanning, we got the Earth level. We generated the digital elevation model. As you can see, it can be shown uh, as a cross-section. Uh, then we generated the canopy of uh, forest vegetation. This is a an average model, weighted average uh, model. And uh, again, we can see some uh, roads, cutting areas, some additional features. So based on this, we can immediately see the situation we have in terms of uh, heights. As a result of comparing altitudinal indicators, we built a digital vegetation model on the surface uh, where uh, the ground, uh, where all forest uh, objects are represented in the surface model or surface matrix. The brown color means h uh, higher objects. Uh, yellow, lower objects, and so on. So, with all the existing cutting sites, and uh, we were able to see how the height of the forest changes. Of course, what we what we can offer is uh, pure mathematics, and the specialist will do the rest. Similarly you can build a fairly rough uh, model, what we call uh, machine relief for logging areas. From that you can naturally build a 3D uh, elevation model. And as uh, people who are not knowledgeable in forest inventory, those who are doing mathematics, uh, we thought of other ways to 
used this information to use the standard model, the profile system, to calculate uh, the quantity or to, to take the total matrix and then uh, break it down by sections. This <coughs> mechanism allows you to uh, determine <coughs> biomass amount for each cutting area. I think that uh, empir empirically uh, we can uh, calculate other indicators uh, based on biomass. In interpretation, we can use composite materials available. For example, this is RGB orthophoto plan near infrared, and the composite materials <coughs> obtained when RGB and infrared bands were combined. You can add uh, digital elevation model or relief model to it. So once again, we are mathematicians. We give you this mathematical model and you as experts decide whether it is convenient to use or not. Why did we put together this um, uh, suggestion, this proposal? Naturally, this is done as a desk study in a camera way once the data, the images have been received. Together with the uh, costless SEP project, we collected some preliminary tentative uh, data without uh, a detailed processing that uh, Photomod and DSOU can uh, provide. We had some general uh, data, but if you want to break it down into tree varieties and whatnot, uh, you have to use other uh, application. It provides some quantitative and qualitative uh, uh, characteristics in infrared band, uh, you will be able to see the water quantity, water logging uh, of the area, and create uh, materials for hard-to-reach places. Uh, so we have areas that are th thickly forested, and scanning scanning doesn't work properly there. Plus, you can determine the size of biomass of, of forest vegetation and um, based on a rough surface model, you can design systems for forest usage and reduce cost uh, for uh, field and forest inventory efforts and that will improve camera work. We have proposals for uh, our colleagues who spoke early, earlier based on their presentation and uh, uh, we outlined uh, territory, an area that could be used and see whether it will be developed further. Uh, thank you for your attention. Uh, are there any questions uh, to Siberian guys? What kind of questions can be swept to Siberian guys? It's pure and simple. We made it. Coffee break. You can have two cups of coffee now.